It's time for the Tonight Dabbler Show. Tonight's guest features the RDC cars, Tier 4 Jeevos, Tank Cars, and a new scope performance from an FL9. And now, here's your host, DJ! Welcome, welcome, welcome everyone to the Tonight Dabbler Show. It is so wonderful to see so many of you people here tonight. Well, uh, you know, a lot of interesting things have been happening. As a matter of fact, I read in the news that a Texas man was found to be growing marijuana on his Z-Gage platform in his basement. Isn't that crazy? Someone in Texas has a Z-Gage layout? That's nuts. Man, I didn't see that coming. Whew. Well, actually, this is a brand new news from the FDA is actually saying that they're coming out with a new drug that's going to prevent men from buying model trains. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, I think we already had that. I think it's called our wives. I don't, I don't know. Isn't that a thing? Speaking of spouses, actually, there is a, uh, there was a latest poll that said that most women think that men that still play with toy trains only can think at a third grade level. Yeah. When guys heard about this everywhere, they said, oh yeah? Well, you're a poopy head. So yeah, there you go. Welcome back to Yankee Devil. Of course, every day is a train show. My name is DJ. Today, we're going to take a look at some items. So hopefully, we'll find our way back on your layout. We're going to get started with a repeat. We took a look at these cars a little bit while ago, but I want to bring them back because we have a whole bunch of them, and they're too good to be sitting here in our store here. Check out these uh, tank cars from American um, Limited. These are fantastic tank cars here. These are the GATC tank cars here and i have a couple of different row names here i got of course i got the santa fe i got a couple different versions of the santa fe i got the northern pacific there and i got the southern pacific there now these are just great looking cars here and again to have them this kind of sitting on our in our store and not on your layout is a crime these are just fantastic looking cars there this will take a look at all the writing all the detailing that goes into these cars here especially like all the writing that's in here i mean these are just awesome looking cars here get the end there with the little shield there and the neat thing about these tank cars is i have a whole bunch of these cars here so if you're looking to create a nice lawn tank car unit train I think these are the way to go here. I love tank cars. It's one of my favorite freight cars. So you definitely need these on your layout. Now these tank cars retail for $64.95. Low pricey, but American Limited makes a great product. And we're selling it here at Yankee Dabbler for $47.99. So if you want to get some really high quality cars rolling on your layout that be the envy of all your tank car friends out there, check out these American Limited models because I know you're really going to enjoy them. Get them rolling today. So our first guest this evening it came all the way from the Susquehanna region. Please welcome this RDC car. Woo! Yeah. This is a RDC car from Walther's, a Proto 1000 series. And if you take a look at this car, this is just an awesome looking car. Now, RDCs are a little bit different than some of the things that we have taken a look at on this show here. But if you're looking for a singular commuter car to run across your rails, this might be the way for you to go. You can get one, you can get two, three, you can go up as many as you want. Now, this is a DC car here. But if you want to add DCC and sound, we recommend using the Digitrack SDH-166D to put inside of here, and then you can have a fully functioning DCC and sound-capable RGC car running on your rails. Now, these cars can actually still be found today running the rails. As a matter of fact, Reading and Norton has a couple of them that they run uh, periodically. And they're just really neat-looking cars here. Now, the retail value for this engine is $139.98, but we're selling it here at Yankee Dabbler for $89.99. So anytime I could get a locomotive, for under $100, I always think that's a good deal. And if you want to make it a DCC and sound locomotive, then the Dakota roughly ranges around $46. So you put that together, you got a really nice looking um, train to run on your rails. So come to Yankee Dabbler, I have a whole bunch of different road names, Susquehanna, b and Southern Pacific, New Haven. I have a whole bunch of them. Type RDC in our website and get the one that you want today.
All right, so the RDC had a lead, had a movie uh, premiered at Slate 4, but our next guest, I know you're going to really love these guys here because we have right from Repito, we got some EMDs, FL9s! Woo! FL9s, yeah. These are awesome looking cars, uh, engines rather, that I have here. The first one is the Main Eastern, and that is definitely a great looking road name there. And then something that I'm sure a lot of us would recognize is the Amtrak FL9 there. And these are just great looking diesel locomotives here. You know, part of the S series, the kind of the final run of the F units here, but these are just great looking details. I love the horns that are in front here. We got the exhaust uh, vent happening there. I have all the different types of uh, detailing that is on top of the locomotive here and that main eastern ah something about those colors this is it stands out it's a great look here and these engines usually ran singular so if you're just looking for a nice a unit to run with your trains i think this is the way for you to go now we have these two versions here but we also have another version that if you're looking to get a little bit creative well i have something interesting for you to see if you're looking for a project i haven't undecorated version as well some assembly required we got a couple of uh, parts happening here so yeah this is a weekend project here but if you're looking for a, a kind of a neat project here to put together a nice looking locomotive at fl9 this might be the way for you to go and if you come here at our store here and on our website we got a whole bunch of paints for you to choose. So you could do anything from picking, let's see, this is limited gold. Ooh, look at that. We have some hunter green. Ooh, let's see, BNM blue. I got some vermilion, REA green. I got all these different colors here. So I can paint this whatever color I want. I can even make this the ugliest train or the most beautiful train I want. It's really up to you. So we get an undecorated version of this engine as well. Now, just like I like to do at our show, we're gonna run it. Let's call that our musical guest star for today. Let's take it away with the FL9s. Performing its latest hit from its newest album, Diesel's Play Christmas Songs, it's the Main Central's version of Jingle Bells! <laughs> Alright, let's really play with it. Alright, so we already heard that horn. What's the bell sound like? Cool. Here's the horn. Now, being a Rapido engine, it also has some goofy sound effects in here, so let's take a listen to them. Maybe you're looking for a uh, place to shop. Well, here's a advertisement for one. Alright, so go to Crazy Eddie's. What else do we got here? That's pretty cool. All right, so let's get our uh, started here. All aboard.
Yeah, let's pull a uh, tank car train on here. All aboard. Now arriving at the NPC Studios, train number 488, Main Central Tank Cars. Cool. All right, so that locomotive retails for 390, I'm sorry, Three forty nine ninety five, but we're selling here at Yankee Diablo for two ninety nine ninety nine for the undecorated version, and three fourteen ninety nine for the Amtrak and the Main Central. So they're great engines. Get them rolling on your roster. I guarantee you don't have anything like them. And once again, you're gonna be the envy of everyone in the model railroading industry. What a great show we're having! It's time for everyone's favorite segment, the top ten list. Here we go. Today's category, <clears throat> the top 10 ways that you can tell that you're really obsessed with model railroading. Uh, number 10, all the pictures in your wallet are of trains instead of your children. Number 9, you can remember all of your DCC addresses, but none of your important anniversary dates. Number 8, you took your spouse to a nice romantic dinner and date at the local train show. Number seven, you named your children CSX and Conrail. Hmm. Number six, you replaced your car horn with a steam whistle. That's, that's going to be interesting to see. Uh, number five, your boss keeps telling you to stop wearing your engineer hat and overalls at work. A little embarrassing there. Uh, number four, you replace all of your dinner plates with gondolas. Hmm. Uh, number three, you have an evacuation plan to save your trains in case of a house fire. Uh, your family will figure it out. Uh, number two, every time you start your car, you beep your horn twice to go forward and three times to go reverse. Wait, I think we've all done that, right? And the number one way you can tell that you're really obsessed with model railroading, you're tolerating my nonsense to watch trains run on our show. There we are. That was our top ten list. And it was all worth it because our final guests for this evening are these tier four Jeevos from Scale Trains. Check out these engines here. I think these are some awesome looking engines here. Now, first one that we have here is the Canadian National. This is actually a veteran's locomotive here. And I love the look of that engine there where you see the American flag and the Canadian flag back to back. That looks fantastic. I really love that look here. On my non-power track back here, I have a Burlington Northern Santa Fe diesel. And, I mean, everyone just loves those colors. That is a great look there. I think you're really going to like that one if you're a BNSF fan. Kansas City Southern is right here, and I think that is, again, another one of those fantastic paint schemes there. That is a fantastic looking locomotive. I love the silver roof here. Good shot of this roof up here with all the detailings over here. I mean, there's just so much neat stuff happening there. I love it. Speaking of another one I really like here, it's the Union Pacific. I love that uh, big pa flag paint scheme in the middle here. I actually hear that they're going to tone that down a little bit, so if you want the original version there, there you go. We have Norfolk sending here, classic black and white. Everyone loves NS. And then finally, we have the CSX. And it doesn't get much better than that if you're a CSX fan. Now, these are scale train locomotives here. And the neat thing about these engines is that they are very affordable if you're looking for a Jeeva. So the retail price for these engines is $319.99. But we're selling them here at Yankee Dabbler for $259.99. Fantastic deal to get on a scale train locomotive. And they're really pretty to look at. But we're going to run them because, well, I have a problem. I just can't stop running trains. So let's go. Double header going of a Norfolk Southern Kansas City Southern train. So check that out. As you can see already, I got those ditch lights on. Let's uh, get them fired up.
And that's kind of cool. Both of them had a different startup sequence. Here is the horn. Which of course rings the bell as well. And there we go. Pulled by his hand card chain. All aboard. Now arriving on track number one, a black and white engine and a not black and white engine. Cool. Now these engines are really cool and this hearing both of them in tandem with each other, one of them still running. Just hearing those engines in tandem with each other, with the power, the sound, it just sounds fantastic. So I think you definitely need, definitely need one, two, or six of these on your layout. Well, once again, these engines retail for $319.99, but we're selling them here at Yankee Dabbler for $259.99. Come and get these engines before they're not going to be here. These guys are not going to last forever. So come to Yankee Dabbler and get these today. Well, that's it for everyone here at the Tonight Dabbler Show. I hope you enjoyed our performance. We had a fantastic lineup. Once again, we had these Tier 4 Jeevos from Scale Trains. We had the RDC from Walther's. And, of course, the decoder. You can make that sound locomotive. We have these tank cars here from American Limited. And then, of course, we had those FL9 diesel locomotives from Rapido. So we got a whole bunch of things for your consideration that, once again, will hopefully find a way on your layout. But if none of these things interest you, don't worry, because we have our website, yankeedabbler.com, where we're adding continuously every day, adding new items that hopefully will your interest and find their way on your layout if you're not already subscribed to engineer hall's channel i don't know what you're doing make sure you click that subscribe button and get caught up on all the latest and greatest things that are coming up we have we're almost approaching the end of summer so you know what that means fall is right around the corner and we're going to give you getting ready to get back in the train season which for most people is a year-round thing but still hey it sounded good right so make sure you click that subscribe button and get caught up on all the latest things that we have happening on the channel well we're gonna change it up we're gonna go to engineer hall this week for our rail fan video we're gonna take a look at that brand new acela train in philadelphia so i hope you enjoyed this rail fan video our apologies to matt damon we ran long so we had to bump him but we'll see him next time for everyone here at the tonight dabbler show take care and uh we'll see you later bye bye Woo! Yeah. Oh man, that's great.